about how to clean the patient's dentures and what to tell them how to clean them when they're at home. So the biggest thing is, yes, they need to take out their removable dentures at night. Whether it's a partial, a full denture, two full dentures, it doesn't matter, needs to be taken out at night. You will have patients that say to you, no, I'm not taking them out at night. I'm not sleeping with no teeth. But what they have to remember is their mouth. Their mouth under the dentures needs to be able to properly heal itself and get that air. I mean, it's not air, but it just simply needs to be able to not have an appliance on it all day, all night. It needs to properly be able to breathe, okay? So that's what I tell patients. If they're not taking it out at night, they could develop cold sores, they could develop inflammation. There's so many things that could be happening underneath. They need to be taken out. As a side note, if I have patients that, that just simply say that's not happening, then I tell them, then you need to be taking them out sometime during the day. Do you watch a movie for two hours at night? You need to take them out to allow your mouth to have that space to heal properly and have it be no issue. So the patient needs to be taking them out at night and they should be storing them in a closed container with a denture solution or a tablet solution with water, that kind of thing. That helps to get rid of that bacteria and helps to clean the denture. So in a closed container with solution and water. Now they should be cleaning their denture before with a soft denture toothbrush and toothpaste or some sort of like dentures um, paste but it cannot be abrasive. So something non-abrasive is the main thing. I have patients that want to use soap. I let them know toothpaste kind of makes more sense, but I guess some toothpaste is considered abrasive. So if they want to use soap, just make sure it's non-abrasive, but how do you really do that? I don't know, but make sure that they're rinsing the denture afterwards because you don't put soap in your mouth for a reason. It's not meant to be in the mouth, right? So that's, that's what I tell patients as well. And when they're brushing the denture, they must fill the sink partially with water. So that way, if they're cleaning it and the denture slips out of their hands, it's not going to crack or break because it goes into the sink with water or a towel lining the sink, something like that. So if they mistakenly drop the denture, it does happen, it's not going to break because dentures are very expensive to fix. So that's something I want you guys to let your patients know. Um, so yes, it is okay to submerge them overnight with a cleaning solution. In some textbooks, they tell you not to do that, but in the most updated one, shoot, I forget the year, but that is still what we want to do. The main thing is it needs to be done at night. It needs to be cleaned every day. There are denture solutions. There are extra soft like denture cleaning appliances. It must be done. If the denture isn't being cleaned, if it's not being removed at night, think about the gums underneath. Think about the patient's mouth underneath the dentures. They're going to develop sores like probably plaque stuff is going to collect in there. That's a lot of bacteria, not good. They should also be taking a very soft brush when they take out the denture and then cleaning inside their mouth as well, because their mouth still needs that cleaning factor to it. So let me know you guys have any questions. This is very important and I'll see you guys in the next one.